Hello friends, welcome to the Smart Excel. This video is on having a comparison sheet and just selecting the lowest service rate and the service provided. When you have when you have a, st a statement like this in this format. Before the previous video, we had only one for one uh, one unit, and you can see that there was a rate, and you can compare that. But now, if we have more than one unit, so I'm going to show you how to do this formula. And apart from that, I'm going to show you this in the, in the next video. So when we have three things to be done, like the lowest rate service provider and the contract type, that's non seamless and comprehensive. So this will be covered in the next video. So how to do this, I'm going to show you in this video. So let's start with this. So I'm going to select the lowest rate. So if you want you can, to use a small form, but that is not possible here because a small formula is an array formula. If you select, uh, these are my targets in form of, form of, form of, and uh, the k value is 1. k value is 1. So it gives an error. And if you select as a, an array, select the whole thing, then you get the answer as 12, comma 1, then you get 12, because 12 is not what I'm looking for, I'm looking for only these, these things, so this in the bold, I'm looking for these areas only, I'm targeting that area, so you can use a minimum formula, so minimum formula also, you cannot take this as an array, because again the same thing, you will be repeating, this is an array. So you have to set one by one. So the first thing you will be taking is this value, comma, this. So again, so 16 is the lowest. Time. So this is the right answer. So I'm going to who is the games, who, in, who, is, who is the service provider who is giving that amount. So this is AI. So now I'm going to use formula again separately. I'm going to do it together. So and I make a new formula. So I'm going to use a match formula. So my lookup values will be this same targeted area. So this is going to be lookup. So I'm going to copy this. So lookup array can start from I can start from here, but my target will be from this side. So I'm going to select from this only and match type will be zero. So in 16.1, but that is because of I have to use some space. I'm going to double put, put an and so it can segregate each other. So you can see now. So this is my service production showing one. I'm going to make an index for the same. This is going to be my index. I'm going to select this and hit F4. The comma and close the parentheses. So when I bring this down, you can see uh, when it's showing a big because there's no decimal places in this. So I would like to add a decimal place so you can have a decimal in this. So just I'm going to do is I'm going to add a text formula. The value will be the same, the minimum, which is going to end over here in this area. And I'm going to put a comma. The format type will be double quotes uh, zero, segregate zero. So it will be segregating in thousands, dot, and two decimal places or three, whatever. So I'm going to go with two decimal places. And I'm going to close this and close the parentheses. So you can see it's having a. Form over here, so you can 
Easy. The same thing you can go upward also. You can just move it. And again, you can see it has changed and the other side you can. So this is the way you can see that you can get the lowest service provider and the rate and the service provider name. So in case if I add here as 1000, so you can see it has been changed. So I hope you understand this video and in the next video I'm going to show you how to do in the same thing with three type of data and um, uh, I would like you to uh, thank you for watching this video. Please share this video and thank you for watching.